Okay, hey, part four of scientific notation. This is on multiplication and division. Okay, let's look at this problem. We have 2.3 times 10 to the fourth, which is written in scientific notation, times 3.4 times 10 to the third, which is also in scientific notation. Okay, in multiplication and division, unlike uh, addition and subtraction, we're not concerned that much about the powers of the 10. Okay, in addition and subtraction, we needed the powers to be the same. All right, in multiplication, that's not necessary. Let's see what happens. So we have 2.3 uh, times 10 to the fourth times 3.4 times 10 to the third. Okay, now the first thing we do is we're going to multiply the uh, coefficients or our first factors of each uh, scientific notation uh, 2.3 times 3.4. So 2.3 times 3.4 then that's going to be uh, multiplied by 10 to the fourth times 10 to the third. So we're multiplying our first uh, factors or coefficients and then we're multiplying our powers of 10. Okay so our 2.3 times uh, 3 to the fourth if we multiply that out we get 7.82 and then our 10 to the fourth times 10 to the third. If you remember from our uh, video on uh, exponents, when we multiply exponents, this would be 10 to the fourth plus three. So that would be 10 to the seventh. Okay, and that's our answer. All right. All right, let's look at this other one in multiplication. So 5.5 .5 times 10 to the eighth times 8.4 times 10 to the seventh. So again, we're gonna multiply our, our first factors or our coefficients. So we have 5.5 .5 times 8.4. And then we're gonna have multiply our powers of 10. 10 to the eighth times 10 to the seventh. Okay. So 10 to the eighth times 10 to the seventh becomes 10 to the eight plus seven which is 10 to the 15th. And then over here, we have 5.5 .5 times 8.4, and that becomes 46.2, and that's times 10 to the 15th. Now, remember, uh, we cannot have, uh, our first factor can only be, at least it has to be at least one, but it has to be less than 10, okay? So, um, it, this is not less than 10, so we've got to move our decimal one place. That becomes 4.62 times. Now, remember, if, our, uh, if we move our decimal to the left, that means this number is going to decrease this side. So if this side decreases, our power of 10 must increase. So that becomes 10 to the 16th, and that's our answer. And that's, that's how you multiply in scientific notation. Now, Let's look at division. Okay, uh, in division uh, with scientific notation, again, like multiplication, we're not worried about the powers of 10 being the same. Uh, and we're gonna start with our coefficients, our first factor. So we're going to divide 9.6 divided by 3.2, okay, and then We'll have a 10 to the eighth divided by 10 to the fourth, okay? And we're multiplying those. So when we divide 9.6 by 3.2, we get three. And that's gonna be multiplied by 10 to the eighth divided by 10 to the fourth. Now, remember when we divide with exponents, the same base, that's going to equal 10 to the eight minus four. We subtract, so that's gonna give us 10 to the fourth power. So we have three times 10 to the fourth power. All right, let's look at this one. So we're dealing again with our, our first factors, our coefficients, we're gonna have 2.22 divided by 
0.88 and then with our powers of 10 we're going to have 10 to the 4 minus 9 because we are dividing we have 10 to the 4th divided by 10 to the 9th and when we divide exponents we subtract okay so that's going to equal 10 to the negative 5 and then this will equal 0.25 now remember when, when our first factor has to be at least 1 and less than 10 okay so we've got to move our one place so that becomes 2.5 if this becomes larger this side becomes smaller and one less than negative five is negative six so ten to the negative six and that's our, our answer in scientific notation okay so I appreciate you watching we covered uh, how to do uh, division earlier in this video we covered how to do multiplication and this is part four uh, of scientific notation. Uh, thanks for watching and hit the subscribe button and we'll see you on the next video.